Welcome back to my channel. It's Jen here. I'm super excited to take you guys on my adventure to the Bite Beauty Labs. Yes, Bite Beauty Labs. So at the Bite Beauty Labs, I was able to create two different shade and color of lipsticks and I was able to customize pretty much every step of the way. So I have my chosen scent, chosen color, and chosen finish. So yeah let's get into this and let me show you guys first i'm gonna show you guys some clips from the adventure and then i'll be right back with y'all so let's see those first um, is that the problem i don't know what does it look like on my computer hi is it okay Yes. So are all parts of this. All apart is we're gonna choose a shade from our library of two hundred that are exclusive to the lip labs only. So with all apart. It's very straightforward. You're gonna find a shade that we like, then we'll customize the finish and the flavor. They left us okay. They said I'm coming back. Oh, no, it's okay. And then Daniel will give you some of the soup as well. We do have a selfie wall with the ring light. Ooh, awesome. I think I think that's what it is for the everyday. Okay. Perfect. 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 So I'm gonna have you try one of these first, and then we'll kind of bump up to the lighter shades as well. Maybe you want to try this one actually. So let's try this one first. This is gonna be very very nude on you, but I still for your I think on piece of mind I want to show you. Colors have a good amount of light in them. They tend to be a little chalky on a darker lip. We're still going to give you that nice experience. And I'm using that nice and loose blue finish, which has, again, our creamy avocado oil in it. So it's really nice. Okay, so this is the first one that you chose. Let me get you to move on here. It feels good. Is it? Um, yeah. This is a really good thing. With the pork. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's pretty. Just like a little bit of a warmer, really brownish color. We'll see. Mm. Oh, I like the skills on my It's so easy. Um, exactly. Actually, it's really so pretty. Mm. That's how I'm going to eat you with your 
this is pretty right now, yeah. And it's good because I think that floral, which is the color for 2018. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's one. There's one I like to do. Oh my god, I just want to show you options. And then I'm going to do one more, too. Yeah, one more for you to try of a new two. That looks so funny. Because I have an issue. My lips need to dry so freaking quick. That's why I like the sap. Because that avocado will like, like it locks a lot of uh, hydration into it. Yeah. Like, uh, like usually when they're dry, you can see every single line, wrinkle, and everything. Like everything in my lips is more plump. Myself. <laughs> yep. That's so pretty. Especially what this look like. Oh, that looks so pretty. Okay, so from just looking at that, can't you guys tell that? First of all, what is her name? If you guys ever go to that location, you guys should definitely, definitely, definitely um, choose Carissa as the person who helped you guys out with the whole thing because she literally will give you guys the best experience, okay? So let me just let you guys in. Let me just let you guys see some more clips and all of that. Let's just finish out the clips and then I will show you guys the lipsticks. And they come in the cutest packaging. So it's just super exciting, okay? Let's get into it. Let's get into it. Let's go. Go watch that shit. <laughs> Orangey brownish situation. Okay, so your next step is gonna be picking a flavor for each one of your lipsticks. We have quiet. And then I'll also once you pick your things, I'll let you take photos of your acetate. And they're very light. I only do like about two drops. Mix them with the oil. I'll pour them into the mold and then I'll freeze them on top of the inner oil. And everything they completely solidify. So I'm going to spray this part on just to check to make sure our colors are ready. Give it a little maybe like another minute. And then turn it back on its side so it can really cool. What do we got for This is so cool. Very, very cool. I'm good. I'm filming it. Three, two, four, two, three, four. Forty. <laughs> Here they go. They look so pretty. Oh, oh. You know I don't look at that. <laughs> I'm excited. Oh, you just made my day. Let me show you the shade one, and it says everything here. So I'm just gonna read off of that. So with shade one, I chose shade 122. And um, 
my finish was satin and the flavor that i chose was most so freaking good is mango when I tell you, it smells so good every time you just put it on. It's just like, oh my god, I want to eat it. But anyways, let me show you. This is the... Okay, first of all, it already is in my kit. <laughs> but um, this nude is possibly the most perfect nude I've ever had. And it's to perfection because of the way I put it. When I tell you this nude goes amazing on black women. Anyways, let me just swatch it for you guys. Let me just swatch it because I'm getting too excited. Like, I'm overjoyed. So, this is what... You can't see anything. You can't see anything, but this is what the nude is. Dude. And it has a satin finish, so it stays really nice and, and it's very moisturizing. And what I love about Bite is that most of the ingredients in their product about the largest percent percentage of the ingredients in their product is all natural so that's one thing you really will love about the product okay so when i first got in she had me to exfoliate my lips to make sure that the colors laid nicely down in this lip second thing she had me do was prime my lips with their primer in which i will be back for that primer because it was amazing and then she had me put on their lip balm. Amazing. Oh my gosh. Maybe I'm lying about the lip balm part. No, I'm lying. It was just primer. I'm just talking about that because I have the lip balm here. And this is my favorite lip balm. I tell you, it's like super thick. And it really helps with those fine lines in the lip when it comes to putting a lipstick. So anyways, let's get into the second color. Okay. Let me show you guys this card before I get into the second color. So this is the card I received. And it's pretty much a swatch of the color. I asked for accuracy next time you go in. I'm not sure. But that's a swatch of the color as well as all the information for it. In which this is a month old. And I'm definitely going to keep this forever because this lippy is the shit. You know what? I'm going to put it on because... Well, it is on. It's on already, you guys. So, I'm just going to layer it and make it fully on my lip. Still, I'm not turning on lights for you guys, but... Oh, and to all makeup artists, if you guys want to find a really good nude for black women, <laughs> I'm allowed. Take all the notes, okay? So, the next shade was a little bit more bold because, you know, you always have to do that, that natural than that bold so i really okay let me see how i can put this i'm not really into other colors because i like to contour my lips so i feel like contouring your lips only really go well with new colors so i definitely stepped stepped up out of my comfort zone and boom i got a red yeah i know you guys have seen me with red on before but so freaking what i do not wear none of the real lipsticks that i do have i only wear them if i make a video i do not wear them out but this is definitely a lip that's where a lippy that's wearable <clears throat> i tried about four different red lipsticks and they just didn't work and this one was perfect so let me show you guys um it's it's shade 305 and it is a matte finish i made it a matte finish because i feel like glossy or even moisturizing red lippies make my lips look a little old and the flavor was lime when i smelled the lime i just knew it was perfect for the shade so let me show you guys this is what it looked like and it's a really really pretty red i think i'm gonna put it on for you guys hold on okay see uh do you guys already feel it hmm how do you guys feel about the red I feel like you got to say, oh, fuck. I do not want to bring the lights out, so I'm not. You guys have to see it in really good lighting because this red hits. I smell like lime. 
but yeah so those are the lippies that i received i mean, well that i customized at the bite hold on hold on let me say it right at the lip lab by bite larchmont oh yeah um and i'm really in love with the both of them these both will forever be something that i will ever i'm gonna forever keep in my collection so let me show you guys the the packaging so i don't know if this was because it was the month of love aka february or if this is just the packaging at all times but this is it so it's pretty much gray like this really nice shade of gray with black lips on them so and it, it says bite let me give you guys a close-up so this is what it looks like okay so thank you for watching my video i hope you guys liked today's video i hope you guys enjoyed my journey at the lip lab by bite a large one um instructor carissa all that i could just but i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope you guys have given this video a like i'm mean, in a thumbs up as well i hope you guys subscribed if you haven't please go on ahead and just subscribe it ain't nothing too but to do it you know subscribe and then after you're done subscribing hit that bell so that you guys can be the first notified whenever i upload any video okay okay now that i'm seeing this foundation and like i don't think i like it i think it's a little too dark i don't know maybe i'm tripping maybe i'm not it looks really good when i look at myself because it looks like my skin color but with this right here this is not cute i'm looking like i'm a whole up but anyways if you guys like this video give it a thumbs up and i will see you guys later doses